Hi guys, so here we are. We will go into uh, maintain this uh, Oma Zoras, Oma A source uh, 65S. It's a five years old reel. Okay, so let's start. We'll remove the spool cover. Remove the spool cover. So I'll put it here. Okay. So sun sun inside. By the way, uh, guys, this is my first time. To uh, maintain this wheel, this is a uh, five years old wheel. Mm -hmm. So let's check the rock if it's still with this. Without this, so we need to uh, let's see, just simply so apply here so careful okay uh, let's check if it's still with this it's okay it's still with this so no problem Okay, so we need uh, we don't need to uh, remove this. We just put it on. Still okay, guys. If uh, for example, if this is uh, already dry, so all you have to do is to remove this washer, and then this is the drug system. All you have to do is to uh, put a grease on this one. So you hold the grease like uh, what I'm gonna show it to you. I have a little grease on my hand, so just put the grease on the drug system and then you just put it back. So for this reel, you know it's already five years old reel, but still. Uh, grease is there, so I don't need to remove this one. I just have to turn it back. Okay, just simply how to return the cover. Very simple. Just put it back. Then so covers here. So for Akuma, they have the two drug system. Here, this also a drug. <laughs> system okay so this is what they call two drug system I used it before in uh, my last bottom trip I think 2017 almost three years so we will remove the handle Turn the handle uh, clockwise. So no problem, it's still smooth. Remove this one. So this is the reel. Okay, so what we gonna do next? So, okay. First you have to remove the shafting this one and then we will remove the rotor then you need a special tools here uh, this one let me show it yeah this is what you need <laughs>
So we will check what is inside. Okay, this is four screws here. Cover. Okay. Done. Oh, the grease already dried up. to remove is the shopping so we need a bit of screw here yeah so I'm going <laughs> see the grease really dried up two first and then pull the sharp thing upward and then remove the uh, pinion and the pinion the driver Hopefully uh, we can easily pull it up because it's already long time. Okay, smooth. So I already pulled it up. Put it here. Still fine. Still grease is here. So this is what they call the sealed bearing. Uh, pictures of uh, Kuma. Yeah, it's still smooth. Oh, I hear some small sound, so we need to uh, maintain this also. This bearing. If I can remove slowly yeah bearings here so uh, well 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 let's check it later okay so washer so remember the washers thing to do is to remove the rotor so you only need a small screw we have to remove the lock first to remove. 
Okay, and then I will remove this. Yes. So when you remove that clockwise, you remove this nut, turn it clockwise, okay, and you know the reason why I didn't maintain this wheel, because I didn't use it anymore, but I'm planning to use this on our boating trip maybe next month, so that's the reason why I need to open this. Yeah, so, see, I push by my finger, got it, so we already removed the rotor, finger. so careful with the spring here, you see the spring, yeah, it's visible on, so just put it here, then put it here yeah, on this uh, there's a lock here lock one lock so be sure it will be there okay so we will remove now the this is the uh, anti-reverse system so if you know this guys this is the I think this is a salt water these three screws and then uh, remove the pinion gear so press the washer okay and then another washer with with spring so I will put it there and then now we have to remove this one and then pull it up so that we can remove the pinion gear Actually, I don't need, I don't need to remove the pin pinion gear because it's still okay. But uh, for the purpose of tutorial, I have to remove this one. So if you are new in the opening this wheel, you have to be careful in the taking out the screws. You have to group them together. Okay, so done. Now it's open. So there's a big. This is uh, the reverse system. So. Pull it upward. Okay, done. So this is the pinion gear. Okay, it's still smooth. So no need to. Uh, I don't need to. Uh, yeah, if I need to remove, just to show to you, I will remove it. But I think I don't need anything here. Yes. You know, this is a very good wheel for the price. Remember, this is five years old. Before, I I I always used this wheel to to cut uh, queen fish. Okay, so careful with this one. This is the anti reverse bearing. One. So remove it also. Check the bearing slowly. Put it there. Mm -hmm. okay, I'll I will return it back because 
everything is good for the Santa River system. Okay, take note. Okay, to reverse. Uh, you can turn it counter, but not clockwise. Okay. And the next one is the berry. Yeah, that's the blackberry. So that's it. And this is the anti reverse system. Just put it there. So, what we will do now is to take this uh, shafting guide. this with kerosene with salt water I have to rinse everything here with kerosene this one also No problem for the barely, it's still fine, it's still smooth. Yeah, this, this, this is the advantage if you have sealed barely. So, take this one. So, I will, I'll be back later. I have to wash this with kerosene only and then I dried it up. And then assemble, put grease, and that's all. It's easy. This uh, wheel is very easy to maintain. Okay guys, uh, I already cleaned the uh, parts of the kerosene, so if you notice, it's already clean here. It's already clean. So no more. Also clean. No more salt water. So we will assemble the top. We'll start with the spar gear. First, we will uh, put the bearing. Okay, do not forget. I need a grease, so I just took a grease. Look inside. Apply. Apply grease to the areas where there is a moving mechanism. Okay, so I think I already applied all the areas. So we will start with the bearing, the silver bearing. I will check. Yeah, no problem, still smooth. Because you will know if the bearing is not smooth. There are some grinding sound. Oh, this one is real smooth. And remember, guys, uh, this this is a sealed bearing, so do not clean this with kerosene because if you will clean this with kerosene it will get inside there is there is a grease inside so it will affect the performance of the bearing then that's the first part the second part is the spark here Washer then we'll need to do is to put the screw.
Okay. Then I will put this. Holder of the shooting. Put this with this. Okay. to put the pinion gear this one so apply uh, apply a grease on this part apply grease on pinion gear this one okay also inside because this is Then, so put it back. Okay, done. Perfect. Then just apply a one drop of oil. So now what we're gonna do is to lock this one. Mm, yeah, put this one here. You remember, do not forget this. Put it here. Yeah, and then Can lock it now. This one. So, see, the screw here is long. Longer than the other screw. So, it's easy to notice. see it and then the, this one make sure that this spring is in the middle of this guide okay done that's it now let, let, we will put the rotor Sure. Then now the nut. So you have to tighten it counterclockwise. Okay, done. No need to make it very tight. Now I will put the lock. Where's the lock? I need the lock. I think this one. This is the lock which we remove earlier.
the main gear so let's just apply a grease on the area of your main gear okay so After the uh, main gear, the next thing that you, you need to do is to put the shafting now. Where's the shafting? Uh, here. Put the shafting so apply a little grease. Apply some. So shafting is inserted. So next is these two screws for the shaft for the shafting. Just put it here. You know, guys, this is a very very simple. Uh, this is very simple to maintain. The, the, uh, Okay, done. So it's easy. Again, I have to apply grease on all the parts, small grease on the parts of the. Parts of the gears so that uh, it'll be smooth. That's enough. That's enough. So when you repeat, see. Okay, so I will put the Okay, that's all. So I have three. I, I have to put back the main cover. Okay, done. So, okay, guys. Now we will uh, after it after returning the cover. Take note: we have four screws. One is longer than the other. So longer screw. You have to put it here. And just this push. okay, and then the others you can put it anywhere.
Okay, done. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's done. So, guys, okay, guys, it's done. So, if you notice, uh, very smooth you cannot hear any sounds nice reel okay i will return now this pool and this pull up cover cover it Okay, so guys, so if you see guys, very smooth. Guys, if you have some questions or suggestions, please don't forget to write on the comment section below. Thank you very much.